Today I'll be working on my 98 Toyota Supra. We'll be installing the VDM, which is the Vehicle Dynamics Module by AEM. You can data log latitude, longitude, speed, altitude. You can map out a course. Um, shows you your satellite count, just how accurate your signal is. And we'll start out by going over the few of the components in the box. Uh, it'll come with the antenna, which has a long cord and screws into the Vehicle Dynamics Module itself. Uh, it is magnetic. I have some instructions for you, which are very beneficial to seeing the channels you can log, as well as the orientation that the VDM has to be installed in. Along with that, you have a piece of Velcro that'll help you attach the module inside your vehicle. I figured out that the ideal location on a Supra is underneath the central console. This is gonna be as close to the center of the vehicle as you can get, uh, and center as in front to back, as well as left to right. After I removed my center console, I attached a piece of Velcro to the inside of the, to the trans tunnel, and I attached a piece of Velcro to the VDM module. You're gonna wanna be careful how you mount it. The orientation is very important. The way I have it set up, the cord is gonna go towards the back of the vehicle. In the instructions, it'll also tell you the correct orientation in case my video isn't clear. After you have mounted it, you're gonna wanna run your wires down towards the ECU. Make sure that they're tucked away nicely so you don't snag them on anything. The next step is plugging the module into your Infinity Harness. Uh, every Infinity Harness has a four pin AAM net connector. Uh, one of the connectors you plug into that, and if you have any other CAN devices, it'll plug into the other end of the AAM BDM module. Um, the antenna, you're gonna wanna mount ideally on the outside of your vehicle in the center of it, surrounded by at least eight inches of metal. You can then tuck the cord away behind the target top as in a Supra or run it through some sort of molding. Once you have all that plugged in, I'll show you real quick how to log the channels in Infinity Tuner. Uh, what you wanna do is go to Layout. You can right click and add a text grid. And once that screen comes up, you can search for the channels that you wanna log. Uh, if you just type in GPS, there's a couple of them there. Uh, some of the raw channels won't serve you much of a purpose, but you can log them anyways. Uh, you can also type in uh, Excel for acceleration and there's a couple channels there and then Yaw there's a couple channels for that as well Once you select all the channels you can make the screen larger and save your layout for future use uh, The instructions also list all the channels that you can log in case my video isn't clear enough And when I mentioned other CAN devices as BTI gauge will also show you uh, the GPS data that the VDM puts out, such as number of satellites, your GPS speed, uh, acceleration, G's, etc. 